love bugs is rustling back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time stopping by my channel, much love to you and welcome into my returning subs, my growing extended family. We are growing like crazy, like really, really, really crazy. And it is just so beautiful to me and I feel so blessed to be able to have new members uh, in the community and we all can share our experiences and know that we're truly not alone. So with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light and many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already, please like and subscribe, even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. Also, if you're comfortable enough, please drop me a line or two. I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video or you're just up telling me about your impact the gift and how it impacted your life and heading you towards a positive direction also if you feel that the video is being very informative to you or even gives you good vibes you would love to share with a loved one family or friend or even a fellow empath going through some really trying times right now and they need confirmation or validation towards their life path or even their soul purpose please go ahead and share and while you're at it give me a thumbs up like and even share on your social media favorites wherever you see fit and thank you once again for the love and support it's so greatly appreciated and i love y'all from the bottom of my heart and i hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video and today I'm listening to, I haven't heard this one in a long time. I love this one though. Uh, it's called 432 Hertz Miracle Music Phase, uh, Positive Energy, Deep Relaxing and Healing Vibrations of 432 Hertz Music. And I'll post that link in the description box below. My video today is about Twin Flame 101. Hell, because when you leave your footprints in the sand. Oh my gosh. I was going through some crazy stuff yesterday and just releasing. It was like, it was so frustrating yesterday because of the fact that um, we, it was, I don't know what was going on with YouTube, but it was like, anytime like I went to go check my comments, it kept on saying not signed in or whatever. I'm like, yes, the heck I am. I never got signed up. And then you kept going through stuff yesterday. But then when I exited out of it, because I thought it was just like, you know, universe, tell me to sit down, you know, chill out. And basically it was because I, you know, I do videos almost every day. And it was like, I don't know, it was like transition. And I knew something was coming up. But then all of a sudden I seen um, one of my YouTube families that I'm subscribed to, Aluna at Nash, I think Lash or Nash, or I forgot her last name. She put up a new moon. And I was like, you know what? All these shifts and ascensions and, you know, upgrades and downloads that we're all getting. You know, I'm surprised we ain't been cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs because it was just like, I was being really moody and really irritated. I, you know, I went ahead and cleared out my house. A lot of stuff that I got rid of, you know, it's just going room by room, you know, because it's, you know, they always say, you know, when you're in a house or whatever, you pose a clear out stuff but I guess I was just going through my phases of like really missing my dad and stuff like that and I don't know where that came about from well you know I guess it's because his birthday is going to be in a few days so I got really emotional and I kept on hearing footprints in the sand and I love that song by Le Leona Lewis because it reminds me of my dad and my mom you know anytime that um uh, you get like upset or you know things are just not going your way you know if you ever lost a parent you know you know what it means it's just like significant things like father's day is coming up which ugh. <laughs> you know father's day is coming up and then my dad's birthday and then all that stuff and it was just getting it, it was just really getting to me yesterday so you know i just sat there and released and then today you know i kept on hearing footprints in the sand and i looked it up you know, because I've had the, you know, like they, they have the pictures and stuff like that. You hang in the house or whatever. And it was just like, you know, even though you have a strong relationship with God, which I really do. I'm not a religious person, but I'm very spiritual. You know, I know there's a higher power, and which is God and all that stuff. But it was just like when you... Um, when you experience hardship and sorrow, you know, they say you only see two sets of footprints in the sand. And when you see one, it's like God's carrying you. And I just know when I looked at that, I just burst out into tears because it's just like, you know, even though I always try to 
make videos about positive situations. Not every day is going to be good. You know what I'm saying? You go through your you go through your ups and downs. You know, you really feel like, you know, even though you know you're not alone, is this you're just tired of going through stuff. You know, and people get like that. You know, I get like that. And it's just like when I'm like that, I really don't like doing videos and stuff like that unless it's something universe draws me to saying, you know what, you need to allow them to see your vulnerable side. And I'll let y'all see it every once in a while. But y'all already see when I start crying, I start looking up this way like give me a minute <laughs> you know and it's just like you know you I always want to leave a footprint in the sand you know it, it's just like I want to be that comforter for you know empaths that are going through trying times they experience hardship you know and try to make sense of the reason why we go through things like that anybody would you know it's just my dream always to leave footprints in the sand for somebody you know being able to know that I can help you understand why you're going through the things you're going through or reassure you you're not alone you go we go through things all the time but that's a process of life that we got to go through you know we're going to go through you know upgrades we're going to go through downloads you're going to go through ascension you're going to go through uh kundalini spiritual awakening dark night of the sun i mean the soul you know all these different things until we learn how to release all the things that you know has brought us down or even just caused our spiritual awakening that is a shock of our life anyway because it's just like we've been laying dormant for so 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 long and it's just like i want to be able to make the videos to allow people to know you're not the only one going through this you know and it's hard to explain to people if they're not fully awake you know because if you're fully awake then you're like oh, okay i get you i get you you know there are some people that get in contact with me and i don't want you to ever feel like you dumping stuff on me because how would you be able to know what's going on if you're not telling me what's going on and i always tell people if you don't feel comfortable with putting your business out here on my on my on the platform of the videos that's fine you always can get in touch with me you can email me or you can get a hold of me on Facebook messenger look my name up you know and I tell people whatever we talk about is a hundred percent confident um, and confidential you know I don't allow people's business to get out like that I'll just say I'm, oh you know you know that makes a good you know a certain situation makes a good uh, content for a video because it might draw attention to other people that are going through some trying times you know and I love it when y'all drop comments to me saying Rosalyn I really needed to hear this today you know I want to be that one that you know sends out that message early in the morning wherever you are located at. I got so many extended family all over the world which is so beautiful you know overseas I got some in New Zealand Turkey uh Pol Pol Poland I think it's Poland Germany you know all these different places Japan and it, it's just very beautiful because we all go through stuff especially with us being you know impasse we get hit with the hardest stuff you know we're already dealing with our situations and then you're soaking up everybody energy too you know that will make you kind of off you know and it's just like you constantly having headaches and all these different things but know that everything that you're going through is going to serve a positive purpose in your life you know like I did the other video it, it has a divine purpose of the things that you're experiencing to know that you can also you go through your trials and tribulations you heal and then you're opening up telling your story about the things that you've gone through you know that's what we're you know making that chain reaction for you know we all want to change the world but first we have to start with ourselves first you know as I heal you know like I said before you know I thought it was me healing and then helping everybody they said no <laughs> no we he's like you're usually supposed to do it like that but Rosalyn you're a rare case we needed you to go ahead and heal and while you're healing you make these little f up videos because where you f up at and you make the videos and then you let people relate to what you're going through and just be 100% real with it it's just like if that message is ready to be received by that person it will be received if it's not ready you just aren't understanding the answer, uh, ugh, understanding it it must not have been meant for you so it's just like being able to leave a footprint in the sand for somebody to give them that comfort, that reassurance. You know, I always tell people, you know, even though you might be going through some real trying times right now, we have to be able to step outside that box and really see why we're going through this. It's just like with my with my um, 
ex. We were together for almost 21 years. That's a long time. And, you know, being able to deal with that and seeing things for what they truly are, are, you know, it's just like when you're in a narcissistic relationship or whatever, and it's very toxic, you know, sometimes you're so blinded in love, you don't see the red flags that are actually there. And it, I needed to go through all that. It's not just losing my father, but then finding out my family betrayed me and then going through this all at one time and I'm making videos. Damn, that, that, that's some strength right there. <laughs> that's some strength right there but I'm blessed I went through that situation because I would never allow anybody to control me you know loving myself to know I deserve better in my life if you can't love me how I know I need to be loved I know I can at least love myself you know and just do what I got to do heal from everything that's been brought towards me for me to learn from to guide me towards where I need to be you know when you experience a true heartbreak and you can learn from it and heal from it. Like I tell people, please, I know it, it might be a scary situation because I've seen people do it. I've been that way as well, you know, but I feel like, you know, if you're not making my heart skip a beat like that and give me chills when I talk to you, I ain't even about to waste my time. I'm not, <laughs> you know, and then I'm not having sex because you don't know what kind of energy that you're bringing back. You don't want, know what that person has been doing or whatever. And you never know what kind of energy they're carrying. Well enough alone if they have any diseases or anything like that. So it's just like everything I learned has been on a positive mindset. You know, even though it took me a minute to be able to realize that, but then I was like, you know what? I get it. I understand. It took me a minute because I had to get out my feelings first because I'd be pissed. Like, why do I got to keep seeing everybody getting their blessings and I'm not getting anything? You never know what the heck is getting caught up for you. What What's getting put together? So you're going to have to wait. Okay, I got it. And I'm going to keep doing what I need to do, you know, thinking positive. Okay, why well, you're not there yet? Because you have to keep on dealing with things and letting go, seeing what they truly are, being able to forgive and walk away. Not because you need to forgive to forgive them and their what they're doing, just to give yourself a peace of mind. When I can do all that stuff and I'm telling y'all, hey, I'm keeping it real, I'm keeping it 150 with you. If I can add another 250 on top of that, I'm going to do that too. So it's just like when we're all learning from the mistakes that we have been placed in, from the hardship where we're you know, it teaches us a lot about ourselves. That's when you when you cut that alone time out, not trying to be with somebody just because the fact is you feel lonely, but being with the fact that you need to be, God will just take everybody out your life so you can concentrate on you and you only. You know, that's why I tell people, hey, you can get in touch with me between 930 uh what is it eastern standard time to 10 30 eastern standard time before that and after that hey that's my me time and ain't trying to you know be mean or whatever like that because I, I got you but there's times i gotta be worried about myself at that time those are the time you know i'm free with anything else we can talk about anything you want to but it's just like when you're going through stuff like that you really truly need to know you know it's not the fact that god wants you to be by yourself but this is that time for you to work on yourself because you never know what footprint in the sand you're going to be helping anybody else with because it was just like being able to do this has been a blessing for me and i learned from it each and every day being able to heal in so many different ways seeing things for what they truly are you know even though i'm not where i want to be right now that gives me enough time to work on myself you know, and I'm cool with that, you know, and it's just like I learn each and every day, think positive, look at what you're doing, even though when you feel you, you, you know, you're not there yet, look how far you came, those are all the beautiful things that I had to, you know, really pay attention to, look out how many people love the videos you put out, and it allows them to see the things in themselves that they really weren't able to see before, so with all those things being said, you know, that those are the things that really mattered to me. So I hope you were able to resonate, like, and subscribe. Let me know if you're, you know, you, you get this video or you feel like it's, you know, it hits you the right way. I'm going to give my um, post notification shout out to Buddy Pre and uh, Covey The Truth. Much love to you. You know, share, give me a thumbs up, drop me a line. Send out as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can. Know that you are truly blessed, highly favored, and forever loved. And knowing there's always someone out there praying for your better days. And I will see you on my next video, y'all. Much love to you. Peace. Be wild.